I'm Jerry Lopez. I'm 73 years old, and I've been surfing since I was 10 years old. So that's 63 years. Jerry's usually out here for six to eight hours a day, and he'll barely come in to get something to drink. He's, he's in the water all day. What are my hopes? Yeah. Well, I get up every day and still able to paddle out on my surfboard. Pretty simple. You know, one time it took a wave like the pipeline to get me off, but now I can ride a little two foot wave. It still makes me feel pretty good. And that's to me is kind of a, a wonderful thing that expounds on the, the whole subject of what is it about surfing that feels so good, that makes you feel so good. You know, it's just being able to feel that energy. One's more, the other's less, but it's still the same energy. And it still makes you feel good. Generally, I wake up long before the sun comes up so I can get a, at least a couple hours of yoga in. We moved down here initially because we like kiteboarding and it was windy in the winter. And then I rediscovered the surf down here. And once I did that, that was uh, all I needed to do. Every time I go out in the ocean, I'm just trying to be with whatever conditions the ocean is offering, whether it's small waves, big waves, windy waves, whatever. I'm just there for whatever it wants to give me. So at this point in my life, it doesn't matter what the conditions are like, it's about the surfing. And you go out there and you connect with the energy. You're just being a part of that wave. And to me, that's the beauty of it. I think I always have tried to be on friendly terms with the ocean. And I think that's certainly um, help me with my surfing. I'm trying to be friends with the waves. And I think at the pipeline, I achieved that. I had a friendly relationship with a wave that was not very friendly to a lot of people. Surfing is a great gift. And when you're able to share that gift, share that happiness, I think that's when you really find the, the true goal, the true meaning of life. I want to help this guy. Lisa. I think I've always found, and I think most surfers at some point in their careers find that helping someone who's struggling is uh, infinitely more satisfying than just riding waves on your own. People show up and they're, they're just beginners. What he'll do is he'll just tell them how to time it and then he'll push them down into the wave. You know, it's, a, it's all about having a good time here in the ocean. Hey, Judd. Jerry. Hey. Who did I with? Oh, Church of Jerry. So gracious and humble and helpful, giving us little nuggets of advice on how to surf better. And when you go in, you always feel better. Surf for better. Thank you. The redemption is here in every wave. The thing about surfing that's so wonderful is that a little bit of it goes a long way, you know, on some days it's maybe just one turn that you do or one little section that you get on a wave or maybe it doesn't even have anything to do with riding the waves, maybe it's just the sight of a particular wave and you take that with you.
for the rest of the day, sometimes for the rest of the week, sometimes for the rest of the month. I think that's what everybody needs, just have something to feel good about.